What's up creators, back again to discuss the advertiser friendly content guidelines. I'm particularly excited to be doing this little series where we take one guideline a week because of the fact that this is what my full time job is. But of course, my true loyalty lies with the followers of Creator Insider, our favorite channel. So let's get into adult content. That's right, the sexiest guideline of all of them. What we do is, much like we do in the case of almost every other guideline, we break it down into the questions that you see in the self-certification options in the front end. So again, the first option is always going to be full ads, the second limited ads, and the third is no ads, where you shouldn't enable ads on the video at all. In each one of these sections, you're going to find guidance broken down into two main areas. The first is sexually gratifying content, and the second is nudity. So we're taking each one of those three sections and breaking out adult content into those two categories. So for example, when it comes to the full monetization option, what you're going to see is descriptions around romantic scenes where people are just kissing, to the discussion of sex education and how sex works, so long as it's kind of an objective portrayal and doesn't get into discussions of your own personal intimate experiences um, and is not that detailed. Then when it comes to nudity, we highlight that limited clothing is totally fine for full ads, so long as it's in context and in the appropriate situation. So a really good example of that would be somebody in a bikini or bathing suit or swimming trunks at the beach. That's the type of stuff that we're talking about. Then moving into the next section where we talk about limited ads, where you can turn on ads for your content, but advertisers may choose to opt out of appearing on it. That's where things get a little bit more heated. So what we're talking about here is reviews of sex toys, totally fine to run ads, but it is gonna receive limited ads. When it comes to nudity, it's fine if it's censored full nudity, which kind of seems like a contradiction, right? What we're talking about is a character who is portrayed or presented as nude, but all of the intimate body parts are censored, that's fine for ads, it'll just receive limited ads. And then the third option is going to be around content that's devoted to, for example, fetishes. That's something that ads shouldn't be enabled on. And you can see a full li list of the five or six sections uh, or topics there where uh, we advise you not to enable ads at all. And again, we're providing these little snippet videos to just kind of remind you that we're constantly building out this page as a comprehensive resource, everything you need to know if you want to get that high accuracy rate in self-certification. Um, so let us know if you have any feedback. I've already reviewed all of the violence comments over the past week. Uh, on the violence video. We've got some really good examples of where we need to be clearer and do a little bit more in terms of how detailed we are. So give us some feedback on how you're finding these videos, how you're finding the article itself, and make sure that you subscribe to the forum. We're going to link it below and check out the update log as well. If you subscribe to the forum, what you're gonna get is an update every single time we change the page because we actually post to the forum explaining the changes, explaining the updates to the language that we've made each time that we do it. I've been Connor, this has been adult content. Uh, let us know what you think in the comments below.